but yeah, uh, we are uh, we are absolutely gonna need to uh, we are absolutely gonna need to upgrade the altar. So three, uh, so three of these thomium plates uh, coming up. So three of these in the bending machine, and we've got three thomium plates good to go. I think it should be any thomium plate, correct? Yeah, accepts any plate thomium. Okay, we're good. We're good. So we just need to do this. Thomium plates are good. And I need uh, now. I need the uh, wait. Now I need the marble to craft this. So chiseled marble and marble pillars. Got it. Uh, I feel like I can. Can I? Uh, I think I can chisel. Uh, can I? Can I chisel these? It'd be stupid if I couldn't. Yeah, I can chisel these. So, chiseled marble. There we go. The only one I can't chisel to is the ruined marble, but that's because uh, that's because for some reason it needs steel. It needs steel wire. But uh, why? Why does it need steel wire? Mm, don't know if these are the correct spots, but that should be fine. All right. I'm gonna need a bucket of starlight. Don't know if it's gonna take my bucket again, but we'll see. And now I just need that rock crystal. Uh, yay. I'll be back. Okay, I got some rock crystals. Luckily, the rock crystals like uh, luckily I got three of them from one ore. So yeah. Uh, let's do the worst purity. Thirty-one. Thirty-one can go into this. All right. So yeah, we got the starlight crafting altar going now, which means get some things. Uh, so hang on, let's see. Go back here. We can get the Armara paper and 16 sooty marble. Which, uh, let's just double check that recipe. Sooty marble? Uh, well, I can either do locate charcoal with marble in the alchemy array, or I can do coal or charcoal in an alloy smelter with astral marble. All right. Your vision expands. And it didn't take the bucket. Perfect. I'm glad it didn't take the bucket, but now, oh boy. So I need to do this, and I also need to... Thanks! Alright, I just got a lot of things. So, Armara paper, and I also got a potion flask flight 40 seconds. Hmm. How do I make this? Well, this has seven uses, so, hmm. I don't quite get it, but I mean, it's it's fine. It's fine. It's my first. It's my first little bit. So let's see. We just need to. We just need to build the Starlight Crafting Altar now, which is you know just a teensy, just a teensy bit annoying. So nope, not that. I wanted this. There we go. Is that exactly how much marble I needed, by the way? Um, one, two. Oh my god. Um, hold on. I think this, uh, hmm. I think this would let me uh, see that stuff, but I don't know. Maybe I should, maybe I should do, maybe I should make this really quickly. Just, uh, let's see, two gold, three sticks, two glass lenses. Oh wait, I can't make it because I just upgraded my Starlight Crafting Altar. Great, great. Um, hmm. Maybe I should, maybe I should just use this to build out the structure really quickly, just to see if I have enough. So, let's see. So it was, it's a three by three underneath with four on the corners. No, this isn't even close to enough. Um, let's see. Yeah, I need, I, I need to get, I need to get more, uh, I need to get more marble from Astral. Just, okay. Uh, give me just a second. Okay, so, yeah, I need, let's see. Oh wait, I think, yeah, this'll tell me. I need 21 sooty marble, so I need five more sooty marble. Can I use this in the alloy smelter? Doesn't look like it, okay. So five more of these. I need five pieces of coal. Unfortunately, uh, unfortunately I have to use my coal like this, but it's totally fine, totally fine. So, let's see, astral marble, astral marble. There you are. 
I need to put more things away. God, I'm, I have, I keep way too much stuff on me. If you guys haven't noticed, my inventory is always a freaking mess. Like, oh my God. I do not need these two rock crystals. I don't need this. Um, can't use the, can't use the resonating wand with my, uh, with my stuff yet. Um, so I do this and this. A bit more sooty marble. Okay, what else do I need? Mm, more marble. All right. Which means I need some, I need some mana. It'll, it, well, either some mana, or I need to go, or, or I need to go mine up a, another temple, or something. I don't know. Uh, give me just a second. Well, there's still quite a bit of marble to carve up from here without have, without breaking the uh, the actual astral marble. So let's see. Let's see how much I get. Okay, got a lot of marble while I was out there, but uh, you know, inventory is always a problem. So I need it. I need to. Oh my God. Am I out of chest space again? Oh, jeez. I'm literally out of chest space. Oh, jeez. I need, I need, let's see. Yeah, supply chain management might, yeah, this, the modular storage might actually, oh, wait, I can't do that yet because I need nether quartz. Why? Are you actually kidding? I need nether quartz in order to be able to do that? Lovely. Lovely. Okay, let's see. Here. What else do we need? Uh, so we need eight pillars, which I have. Need 24 bricks, 28 arches. Uh, wait a minute. Hold on. Do I already have... Okay, this is already in another chest. This can go up here. Okay, saved a little bit of room. So I need... 28 arches, 24 bricks. I know I have arches. I think they're in... Nope, those are pillars. Here we go. 28 arches. Yep. 8 chiseled. Uh, chiseled. Chiseled. That's engraved. Uh, hold on. Where's the... Here we go. 8 chiseled? Is that what it said? Yeah, 8 chiseled. Eight pillars. Yeah, I think I have. I think I have everything. So let's get. Uh, let's get building. Uh, might as well see what we can do. Um, so I need to. Let's see. Uh, I haven't built this by hand in a while. So let's see. So it's one, two, three, four. Uh, nine by four by nine is what it says. So. One, two, three, four. Why is this at? Why is this over here? Please pick that up. Okay. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. So here would be the but here would be the the crafting altar. Can I not put this here? That's odd. Why can't they place this? Hmm. Because, huh? I don't get it. I did not mean to break that. Do you, do you mind being there? Like. Oh, now I can sit there for some reason. What? I don't get it. Let's see. I mean, this is this is a little compact, sure, but I mean, I I mean, I'm still banking on people sending me uh, submissions for bases to live in. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge, send me them. Like, oh my god. I uh, I mean, I will say I'm not. Uh, I'm definitely not used to doing like. Uh, like having void bases. I, I don't really play a lot of sky blocks, so yeah. I think I think my problem usually lies in just you know trying to learn how uh, well trying to trying to build in a sky block. So let's see. 
It's the bricks. Okay. All right. Uh, so bricks here. Oh my god! I did not mean to break this. Please stop doing that. And I'm just using I'm just using my uh, I'm just using my my jackhammer just because uh, just because I could pick up the dirt immediately as soon as I break it. So yeah. I mean I mean who needs a who needs a ring to magnetization when you have when you have this thing. I mean I still want a ring of magnetization anyway, but you know. So let's see. Come on. There we go. So then the chiseled, I think, goes on top of the pillars. Let's see. The chisel does go on top of the pillars, which is in the corners. Ah, the corners chiseled and then pillar and then pillars on top and then more chiseled. Okay. So chiseled, 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 chiseled. And then pillar, pillar, more chiseled. Okay. Pillar, pillar, chisel. Pillar, pillar, chisel. This is, it's, it's a little tight, but it works. So. And then around the outside, I believe. Um, where's my astral book? There it is. So then, yeah, around the outside is, uh, uh, around the outside is the arches. Uh, give me just a second while I place this, because this is going to take a little bit of time. There we go. We have a functional starlight crafting altar, which means we can do that. We can do some more recipes. Let's see. So we just need to do this, this, this oak wood needs to go in this chest over here. I really don't like how it keeps spitting the oak wood where I can pick it up. So I think this is still doing fine. Yeah, we're back stuffing on cold coke, which is actually really nice. Yeah, we're not we're not using fuel all that often, which is awesome. Uh, let's see. So now that I can do, and now that I have this, I can do. Oh, yeah, Evorcio Dissidia and a Lux Saber. Ooh. With the power of the Atuman Altar, you will be able to infuse yourself with the very power of the stars. Create the altar and set out the pattern of the constellation of your choice to tune when the stars are in the sky. I need the uh, well, I need the telescope first, though. But the Celestial Altar might also be a good idea. Crafting the Celestial Altar will unlock many mid-tier to advanced recipes. These recipes are particularly useful for self-empowerment and mid-game magical utilities. You will also have access to crafting a new tier of Celestial Papers. Cool. But uh, sterling silver is a little ways away. Do you, okay, sterling silver would be the blast furnace of sterling silver dust, which is silver and copper. So I don't have a blast furnace yet, but I uh, I need to work towards that. Oh yeah, and then the iridescent altar would actually uh, that's actually a very very good idea. But I can't do that until I fought the wither and gone to space. So yeah. Perfect. Perfect. Uh, ritual pedestal. Oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Ritual pedestal might actually be a good idea. What? Something seems to be here. Okay. Tomb rock crystal doesn't seem like we know it's there yet, but. Oh, the crystal provided to you by this quest will allow you to create a VCO ritual. This ritual will enable creative flight in its area. Great for creative building around your base. Okay. So that's Vicio. Hmm. Concentrating star. Okay, yeah, starlight infuser. Oh, oh, the starlight infuser is this early. Thaumium screw, electrum plate, liquid starlight, rune marble. Why is the star? Oh, why is the starlight infuser so early? Huh. The infuser is available much earlier than it typically is in Astral. Use use the sextant to see how it's built. If you haven't progressed far enough in Astral's journal. This is a great method for early game diamond processing as well as lapis and infused weapons slash tools. Yeah, I will agree with that. Um, hmm. When the heavens misalign. Huh. After you've turned, attuned yourself and uh, began earning perk experience, and you, you may decide you've made a mistake and want to reset. The shifting star will completely reset all your progress and let you re select a starting attunement. Losing all that XP can be less than desirable, however. 
Later, you can craft your Radiant Stars, which will allow you to stop and keep the experience. To help you on your way, we're giving you a one-time choice of one of these stars now. Go forth and shine bright, friends. Nice. Okay. Due to mod interactions that won't be resolved, the VCO perk for Step Assist is disabled in this pack. Instead, we offer you the delicious taste of Step Assist via the Apple of Stature. Get yours today. Go ahead. Hop to it. So, Apple of Lofty Stature. Eating increases your step height to a full block, like a horse. Eat again to undo. Hmm. Okay, then. So, hmm. All right. So, yeah, uh, it looks like yeah, it looks like I do have some things to do in Astral. Uh, vibrant infused wood, huh? What's the vibrant infused wood do? It makes living wood. Okay. Uh... Yeah, so vibrant infused wood is going to be useful for making living wood later, but, uh, yeah, let's see. Is there anything else I can do at the moment? Um, knacker, I can make knacker, and it'll get me a quest for knacker blocks. Hmm. Light concrete, living rock. Light concrete, actually, oh, right. Light concrete is going to need a mixer. So yeah, mixer, not there yet. Ooh, wisdom wood sticks. I can... Wait, why is the one to the forest? Eh? I don't I don't understand. Yeah, whatever. It's it's fine. It's fine. So Yeah. Uh we just need so we just need to do knacker. Automated knacker. Early method exam. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. But for the blood, yeah. Uh, off with their heads. The Skullfire Sword can scorch normal skeletons, causing them to drop with their skeleton heads. Yeah, this this might actually be uh, mana steel screw. Can't do that just yet. I need I need some mana first. A digital mob ag. Oh yeah, this might actually be kind of useful as well. Pump sooty marble thomium plates. A demonic will. Elf machine casing. Red. Okay, yeah. Well, I mean, I have the Starlight Crafting Altar now, so I can craft that. Um, yeah, I think, I think I'm going to need to do a little bit more stuff. Oh, wait, there's actually this. I completely forgot about that. It gives me a cake. Thanks. But you can't, it, it says, it says the cake is uh, pretty fulfilling, but, uh, I can't exactly just hold it and eat it. I, like, it's a, it's a vanilla cake. I just have to do this. But it does provide some insane saturation, which is nice. Okay, um, yeah, uh, I think I'm gonna need to do some more things between episodes just to, you know, get some more, hey, and get some more stuff, like, uh, hmm, yeah, yeah, just, you know, do more things between the episodes, just, you know, try, uh, try to get some more, some more progress with, uh, rubber or something, I don't know. Alrighty, guys, that was it for this episode of FTP Interactions. Hope you guys enjoyed some magic progress as well as a little bit of technical progress, but, you know. Stay tuned next time. We're probably going to keep working towards an assembling machine. That's one of the goals uh, I want to do, like, very soon. I want to get an assembling machine so that way I can stop using manual tools to craft some parts. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. Later. Later.